let's make this sweet and sour chicken tray bake with pineapple that's better and healthier for you than ordering takeout. This is the perfect meal to spend minimal time in the kitchen still producing a delicious result. We're going to begin with a can of pineapple where we want to separate the juice from the fruit. We're going to add the juice into a pot along with apple cider vinegar and corn flour or arrowroot starch. Whisk that well until it combines and creates a slurry. Then we're going to add tamari soy sauce, some tomato paste, and for sweetness, we're going to add honey. Give that a good whisk and bring to a boil. Once it starts to thicken, remove from the heat and set it aside. Next, we need to prepare the chicken. We will dice into large pieces, drizzle with olive oil, season well, making sure everything's coated and bake for five minutes. In the meantime, we need to prepare the vegetables and we're using a colourful array of vegetables. To begin, we need to dice into large pieces the onions. Then after washing and drying, we need to slice in half the bok choy. Remove the seeds from the capsicum and slice into large diced pieces as well. And finally, we need to cut into florets the broccoli. And last but not least, drain the pineapple from any remaining juice. Now remove the chicken from the oven, push the chicken thighs to the side and then add the onions, place the bok choy in the center of the tray, then around it place the capsicum and to the other end the broccoli. Not forgetting to place the pineapple over the chicken. Then drizzle that delicious sweet and sour sauce over the top and drizzle the vegetables with olive oil and season with some sea salt and pepper. Then place the tray back into the oven and bake for a further 15 minutes or until the chicken and vegetables are cooked. Then I like to top it with some green onions and some sesame seeds and dinner is ready. Now this can be served on its own but we love to pair it up with some lovely steamed rice. Add the steamed rice to a bowl and then top it off with a bok choy, capsicum, the broccoli, those lovely caramelized onions and then the sweet and sour chicken and pineapple. And not forgetting to top it off with a good drizzle of that sweet and sour sauce. This is one of those recipes that you will adore and make time and time again. It also makes great for meal prepping and it is totally delicious. And it's as simple as that. Enjoy.